Hello everybody, I am Ace Creeper and today I'm back with a brand new video. Today, we're looking at Torchwood again, we're uh, reacting to a bit of Torchwood. It's been a while for me, it's been about a month since I've uh, last recorded one of these things. It's a bit of a mess, it's been a week for you, it's been a month for me. Um, but today we're back, I have caught up with the episodes in between episode 1 and episode 6, so sorry if you want me to react to those, but it's, some of it's done in advance, some of it's, it, it's, it's a bit of a confusing one, but yeah. So I'm going to give me my opinions on those episodes. Um, so obviously you know I loved Kiss Kiss Bang Bang when I reacted to it. I told you all that. Sleeper was the next one. I thought that was, a, you know, again, a really solid story. Like, again, upped with the scale. Very interesting concept. Kind of made you think different things throughout it. And so, yeah, I mean, it was a bit brutal as well. Unfortunately for me, to The Last Man was a bit dull. Like, I thought it was okay, but probably one of the weaker... Stories. Now, people might not might not agree with me on that one. That might be the sort of general unpopular opinion. But I thought compared to Sleeper and Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, it didn't really hold up as well. It felt more like a Torchwood Series 1 episode. And it would fit right in there. It wasn't as bad as that other one that I can't remember. The one that felt a little bit like Love and Monsters. But this one, it was just, it was alright. It was fine. I just didn't think it was anything exciting and brilliant and amazing. You know, the time travel thing was interesting, but... It, was, it wasn't much. It didn't do anything for me. Meat was a good one for me. I quite liked that one. It was a bit of an interesting concept, bit more of a real world one, and it was finally nice to involve Reese. Oh, God, I hope that's his name. I hope I haven't buggered that one up. Um, actually understand what Torchwood is, and actually remember what Torchwood is, and it was a fantastic episode for Eve Miles as Gwen, and obviously Reese as well, if that's his name, and I haven't just messed that up. It was alright, it was a good episode for them, and I actually quite enjoyed that. Adam was a fantastic episode, absolutely smashed it out of the park, a really intriguing concept, learned a little bit about Jack's history, which I was really intrigued with, um... And overall, yeah, a really interesting concept that I'd never really seen done before. Very interesting, kicked off the episode very well, and I thought it was quite enjoyable. Today, uh, I've been suggested by the Discord people to react to Reset, um, which is episode 6, so I'm watching today. I believe I'm watching episode 7 as well, but I'll, um, I'll talk about that at the end. So yeah, I have no idea what to expect with Reset. Let's get into it. I don't really like these big obnoxious, uh, obnoxious intros. Not a big fan of them, to be honest with you. But yeah, I mean... They do their job. I just wish we just get right into the episode. Because we've already got an intro. Like, we don't need this. Not a clue what's going on currently, but, um, count me intrigued. <laughs> you know, I will say that the, um, the masks for the Weevils look really good and realistic, and they always look great and really creepy, and I don't really. A little bit uncomfortable to watch. Oh, it's Phil Mitchell. <laughs> oh, that is great. That is. Sorry for the slamming, but. Your boy loves a Boomtown reference. Oh, I know what this is. I know what this is. I know what this is. I think I know what this is. Because I know there's a character from Doctor Who who appears in this series. I didn't... Well, no, the show. I mean... I didn't... But it's Martha's theme, so... Yes. Oh, my God, is it? Yes, it is. Oh, my God. What? Brilliant. So, I knew she was in the show at some point. Didn't know it was this soon. So, I'm... Oh, great. In the, in the credits as well. I love the subtle touch of Martha's theme. That's really nice. Oh. Jesus. Mm -mm. I hope I hope Martha isn't just overly confident and arsy to the rest of the Torchwood team. That would be a bit... Mm. You must have thought he owed you a favour. Huh. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> so the Doctor got... Martha in a unit. That makes sense. And I like how this is, presumably, again, this is before Series 4, isn't it? It's also a plot device, and it's going to be used at the end of the story. <laughs> Sorry, Yanto's reaction to that was just incredible. Oh, man. But yeah, it's interesting to have Martha here fill the gap between Series 3 and Series 4 a little bit. The weird zooms and direction in this episode is slightly off-putting, but, um, yeah, sure, why not? What is it with both of them and just, like, practically never talking about the Doctor? That's one thing I would have really liked, you know, like, for the Doctor to show up. I don't think he does, because, you know, I would have heard about it, I would have seen it. I lucky wish, like, the Doctor appeared at some point. It would have been nice, a bit different. Even if it is a more adult show. The story is not amazing so far. Like, I'm not intrigued. I'm just interested because Martha's here. I think that's probably why people want me to react to it, is because Martha's back. 
just hope it ends up being good, because Christ. Um, I'll be honest with you. Um, just watching this episode a bit, I just, I, t I don't know how I feel about this episode. Like, like it's fine, but and it's great that Martha's there, but the story itself is really kind of just. I don't know, it just feels slow and weak. Best part of the episode so far is like just having a conversation and sitting down. I just feel like the general other things is like there's an alien and it's infecting people and it's in a pharmacy. Like when series two of Torchwood started, the scale and the site, everything was increased and this again, just similar to that one that I talked about before at the beginning of the episode, it just feels like a series one episode, just very basic. Nice references. But you'd have to watch Doctor Who to get it, which I like, because obviously, I don't know, it just, it, it's a nice little difference that I quite like to see, and, which is a shame, because I'd wish Martha would come back in a, an episode like Sleeper, or Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, where it's like, the scale feels great, the episode is great, and Martha's an addition. Yeah, this is good, it's slow, it's really slow, but I don't mind it, it's not the worst episode I've ever seen. Okay, just... Because of this, doesn't mean I'm going to stop flirting. You can be <laughs> king of flirts. Okay. Right then. Okay, that's adorable. I swear to God, if anything happens to either of those two this series, I'm not going to be happy. Okay? I, I might cry. <laughs> I'm, I'm joking, I really hope nothing happens. <laughs> oh no, I've, I've jinxed it now. Right, Martha, yeah. Ooh, this is weird. I don't, I don't like this hair. I don't like creeping in around places at night. She's gonna get kidnapped, she's gonna get stabbed, she's gonna get... She's gonna get a needle in the eye, and she's gonna die before she appears in series four. Oh. Mm. Easy peasy. That was a weird cut. Why did they do that? Why did they speed that up? Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Come on. Get over it, come on. Oh, suspense! Suspense! Why? Why even bother with the whole suspense shtick? It just feels a bit redundant, doesn't it, really? Get out. There's a staircase there. Get out that way. I just don't feel comfortable with this. So is there actually... Oh, dear. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Okay. I'm a fan of this. I like this bit. This is cool. Oh, Christ. I thought they actually killed her there. I know, obviously, she's in Series 4, but still, like... Ah, don't show it. Don't show it. Interesting how they... It's like a sort of medical discovery thing. They're doing it incredibly unethically. Dun dun dun. Da 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 tractor. Alright, never mind. Yeah, this is a slow episode. I don't. I'll be interested to see what people think of this episode, like when I finish watching it and go on Discord and Twitter and stuff. I'll be interested to see what people think, because I'm not enjoying it that much. Like, it's interesting, but. What's it? Oh, that's weird. No, don't like that. Mm -mm. She just rip her arms out of the things there. Jesus. What have you done? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I just thought like they built it into a big more just dead. <laughs> oh yeah, 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 yeah. Jack's gonna die and then he's gonna stand up again. Wait. Don't you do- No! Owen's not gonna die. Owen is not going to- No. 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 What? What? Eh? Where the hell did that come from? It's just dead. What? It does not end like that. Well, there we go. That's- that's- uh, that's- that's- <laughs> That's Torchwood Series 2 Episode 6 reaction. What? Well then, that was, um... That was Torchwood Series 2 Episode 6 reset. Probably the biggest out-of-nowhere cliffhanger ending I've ever seen. I mean, I'm not criticising it, because if he's dead, that's really sad. And I'm a little bit upset, because I think he actually might be dead. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Um, but I'm low-key really worried now. We are reacting to episode 7, by the way. That's that's uh, the next one we're going to react to. I'm not going to say next week, 
because I don't know yet. I've got a lot of stuff on at the moment in terms of real life stuff. There's either been an update video or there's going to be an update video very soon. Where it might actually be like, I'm going to just double check my schedule just in case because... Yeah, so on Saturday, there will be an update video, I think, if this is going out on Thursday the 12th. Um, on Saturday, there'll be an update video breaking down, basically, what's happening over the next few weeks and then over the rest of the year. Because that's important, um, and I might not, you know, it, I doubt episode 7 reaction will be next week. It might be the week after, it might be the week after that. We'll see. Wait and see, because currently I'm filming this two weeks before this goes out, so just so you get a bit of perspective, I don't really know what my deal is in two weeks time so we'll see um but yeah next one we're reacting to is episode seven i'm gonna have to watch that now and get it out of the way because that's really really weird the overall the episode right so the episode was good but not really like it wasn't amazing it was very basic felt like a series one torchwood episode loved the martha stuff thought it was dead interesting there was a few bits that helped me in suspense a little bit um and owen's death came out of nowhere and i really hope he's not dead but kind of think he is dead so yeah, that's great. Gonna have to watch episode 7 now, though. So that's that. Uh, I'm gonna get that out of the way. And um, yes, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, you can always leave a like. That really does appreciate... Really does appreciate... No, it really does help, and I really appreciate it. Um, comment below for any more reaction suggestions in the future. If there's any Doctor Who episodes you want me to react to every now and then. That's always down and optional in the comments to have a look at and whatever. You can subscribe to the channel as well. The notifications on because YouTube's a bit of a mess. So that always helps, and we're getting great subscribers at the moment a lot of people coming in to the channel for the very first time so if this is your first uh, video of mine hope i've entertained you enough and i hope i haven't bored you so yeah please subscribe that'll be great we've also got a patreon page if you want to support the channel a little bit more and just a subscription and a view the patreon page is always there early access content who knows and yeah that's pretty much that from me uh, we've got a discord server social media stuff but that's all in the description you can have a look at that yourself i'm sure you're competent enough let's uh yeah so thank you so much for watching i hope you have a lovely day and i'll see you all next time Bye bye